Hey guys, Jonathan here from TechMajesty.com. So I have here the brand new iPhone 7. It was just released today and I'm going to show you step by step through this easy process how to unlock it. Now I'm showing you this on the iPhone 7 but it will also work on all other iPhone models as well including the iPhone 4S, 5, 5S, 5C, 6, 6 Plus, 6S, 6S Plus, SE, and the 7 Plus. Our iPhone Unlock will unlock any iPhone regardless of any outstanding balances, financing, contracts, blacklist status, etc. So once the phone has been unlocked, you'll be able to use it with any GSM carrier of your choice, both in the US and internationally. The unlock will not affect your warranty and it will also increase the resale value of your phone. To unlock the phone, you will need your computer, it can be a Mac or PC, the latest version of iTunes, a non-allowed SIM card, which basically means a SIM that is not from your original carrier, and a USB cable. If you do not have a non-allowed SIM card, later on in the video I'll show you how to unlock the phone using no SIM card at all. Now that we have all that ready, let's begin. The first thing we will need is the 15 digit IMEI number of the phone, which we will get by going to the dialer of the phone and dialing star pound zero six pound. This will give us the 15 digit IMEI number. So now that we have the IMEI number of the iPhone, we will go on the computer and open the internet browser to go to techmajesty.com. Once we are on this website, we will place an order to unlock our iPhone. We will choose the iPhone 7 since that is the phone we are unlocking today. Then for the carrier option, you will choose the carrier your iPhone is locked to, such as AT&T, T-Mobile, Verizon, Sprint, Boost Mobile, etc. I'm going to choose Sprint since that is the carrier my iPhone 7 is locked to. After that, we will enter the 15-digit IMEI number that we got earlier in the video. Then you will click on the Add to Cart button and go through the checkout process to complete your order. Once you complete the checkout, you will receive an email within the stated time frame informing you that your iPhone has been unlocked. The email will look like this and say Order and Closed, and it will let you know that your iPhone has been successfully factory unlocked and it will include full instructions on how to complete the unlock. We will be using the first method and using iTunes and a non-allowed SIM card to unlock the phone. Now, if you do not have a non-allowed SIM or any SIM card for that matter, then you can simply restore the iPhone as a new phone through iTunes to complete the unlock as well. Make sure you do not restore it just from the backup because in order for the unlock process to be completed, the phone must be restored as a new iPhone. You can then later restore from backup or from the iCloud to get your data back. So go ahead and grab your iPhone and insert the non-allowed SIM card into the phone. My phone is locked to Sprint but I would like to use AT&T on it so I will be inserting my AT&T SIM card into the phone. Once the SIM card has been inserted, go ahead and grab your USB cable and connect one end to the computer and the other end to the iPhone. Now that we have the iPhone connected to the computer, open up iTunes and wait for iTunes to detect the iPhone. Once iTunes detects the iPhone, you'll get the following message saying congratulations, your iPhone has been unlocked. So that's it, the phone is now permanently factory unlocked and you can restore, upgrade or do anything else to the phone and the phone will remain unlocked. As you can see, AT&T LTE is listed at the top left corner of the screen so the unlock worked perfectly. So guys, it's as simple as that to unlock your iPhone and start using it with any GSM carrier of your choice in the US or internationally. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and don't forget to subscribe if this video helped you. Thank you so much for watching.